No, your eyes do not deceive you. It's GD and it's Farm Sim. Okay, after taking a rather long break, is it a, a, sabbat, a sabbatical? A sab it's a break from Farm Sim. I'm coming back. Gonna see. Gonna see if I can uh, slowly ease myself back in. Back into Farm Sim. I've been over onto the mod hub. I haven't really downloaded any any new mods. I've still got pretty much everything I was running uh, when I was playing uh, Attingham. So pretty much kept everything that I know. Haven't really gone for much um, for anything kind of new that's out. Apart from the map, we are on Chadlington. Now, there was a few maps out there that I was looking at or thinking about having a little play around with and I was going to do some stuff off camera just play offline see how the game feels see how I feel with it and then I thought you know what nah screw it let's get right back into it yeah and let's just see what see what happens see how long it rolls for and see how I feel whilst uh, whilst having a little having a little play about so as I said we are on Chad Linton I have had to pause time because I forgot to pause it when I started up, so things don't change. Um, we've got the defender in front of us. We've got some vehicles over at the field that we're going to get harvested today. Just starting off with um, everything that uh, that you normally start with. So it's just these here, and we are going to be harvesting field one, which has the oats in it. Uh, I think that's no, yeah, oats. So we're going to be for harvesting field one. We've got a couple of soybean fields here. We've got what the hell is that? Hang on, is that got oil seed radish already in it, ready to plow in? That's interesting, actually. And we've got some uh wheat here and some uh corn as well, by the looks of it. So I'm gonna have to get myself. A corn header as well. But that's a nice little block of fields that we're going to get started off with, I think. Um, we've got some sort of, I think we've got a little bit of grassland around here, which we can uh, which we can have a look at. Um, a couple of issues I've already found with the map is uh, there's a few floating cars and stuff, um, which I, I kind of expect um, with with maps anyway. Um, but the FPS on this map, when you first load in, is ridiculous. Like, teens, 13, 14, 15, then it levels out, levels out to 60. So, but, but it's not, it's not, yeah, I don't know why it does that straight off, straight off the bat. Um, I am, I'll say only, it shouldn't be only, but I'm only running a 30, 60, um, but um, but yeah. So once it's once it's in and loaded, it seems to be all right. Okay, we are going to hop ourselves into the old defender here. We're going to get it all revved up, started up. Is that a bit loud? That sounds a bit loud, actually, in my in my ears. But we're going to get out. Should we go do some first person. Let me just turn that down a minute. Let's crank you down just to seventy and see how that. See how that rolls, shall we? Right. Let's get down to the f to said field. I haven't even looked around this map. And um but it feels quite nice. It does feel quite nice, I'm not gonna lie. But if I just my FPS, I mean, I'm in a vehicle and I'm getting like 30. Um and I do know that I, I've always struggled with FS. Um with uh with fps and stuff so but i mean once you if you're outside i mean you're getting getting sort of 60 they're all there about i mean there's obviously a bit more a bit more going on when you're inside of a vehicle but if you don't have the fps showing you can't really really see that there's an issue so but we're going to come down into this field it's not going to be just a full-on um, you're going to watch me 
harvest and I'm gonna waffle on for half an hour. I'm gonna I'm gonna attempt a bit of a time lapse, I think. So as you can see, we've got we've got the Massey Ferguson uh, ideal harvester. We've got the honeybee header on it. We've got the class Axion. I think it's the is it the eight hundred that you start off with. Let's have a quick look. Uh. Yeah, 870. Um, I've gone and got myself the Richard Weston, the SF-16. That's a lovely, lovely looking trailer. I like that. Uh, so we've got the Honeybee header on the Massey Ideal. Um, we've got the Crary. It's like the airflow system and stuff. It just said, do you want this? And I went, yes. Do you want this? Yes. Just stuck everything on it. So it looks really, it just looks like an absolute beast and this is the field we will be harvesting ready to harvest yes it is see i don't, see, I don't even i don't even check anymore um i do believe i still have all of my textures in from before i haven't done anything with the nvidia settings yet i have done an update so they're not uh, they're not visible at the moment so before we get going, hang on, before we get going, that couldn't have been timed any better. I, you, you might hear it in my voice, I am rough today. Um, I think I got a touch of hay fever or an allergy of some description and my nose will not stop running and I cannot stop sneezing. So, there might be a lot of jump cuts in this. Um, I'm not even sure if the camera's gonna be on because I look rough as fuck. So, um, but we'll see. We'll see about that. But if you hear any sniffles and sniveling, I do apologise. I will try and not do it and I will try and edit out if I can. But um, obviously, I'm not going to be able to get each and every one of them. So if it, if it freaks anyone out or makes anyone go squidgly, I do apologise and I am very very sorry but bear with me and um yeah hopefully it won't be it won't be too bad but right should we just get into the harvester and start uh getting things off and running i've got vca all set up all ready to go what i'm going to do is i'm going to run a couple of he uh, headlands first i think um this is oats so we can get straw off of this so I think I might run a couple of headlands and not put any straw swath down. Um, if I can remember how to work things. Uh, you are... So if you're in, you're not swathing. Is that right? I think. I think that's, 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 that's how it works, possibly. I don't know. We will find out. So let's do that. Uh, we need to... I think we need to unfold you. Wow. Unfold you. And now we need to unfold this monster. I wanted to start using some stuff that I haven't used before. Oh, by the way, we've got the cherry box on the front of the class over there as well, which I thought was pretty damn cool. So we're going to not do that. We're going to do that. We're going to do you. Going to turn everything on i've got lubricating grease on as well so um yeah you are definitely not um you are chopping the straw by the looks of the back of that let's see if we've got enough power to run through here and let's see let's see what happens yeah we are absolutely um chopping the straw up and we are not putting anything uh, we are not swathing it up at the moment, which we will do, but we'll do that in the middle, I think, in the middle of the field. I might have to turn the game sound down a little bit um, as well. But this is, um, we're harvesting about, what well, we're doing, 10, 10 kilometers an hour at the moment. So it's not exactly the fastest harvesting in the world. Um, but um, I am running, I'm running a lot of mods, but I don't think I'm running anything that's going to interfere with the, uh, with uh, with uh, harvesting speeds like uh, is it harvest? I can't remember what the name of the mod is now, but um, 
but we will definitely yeah we'll see um we'll see what happens but uh hopefully hopefully we can get into get into a bit of this and uh yeah we'll just we'll just see how things go i've just i've kind of felt a little bit maybe not bored but i've I've always said, for, for people that have been around the channel long enough, I've always said, farming is farming. And that is right back from when I was in uh, doing FS17, when I first started off, so 17, 19, 22 now, and pushing into 25. It just feels a little bit samey. No matter what you do, you keep they keep throwing all the little things, the, the added extras in and stuff, you know, but at the end of the day, farming is farming and that's how I feel how I feel the game is. So you have to be very, very clever and I, I take my hat off, but I don't take my hat off. Actually, literally. Metaphorically, wow there's some big words coming out. I don't know if they're in the right context, but I do I do have a lot of respect for people out there that can produce content on farm sim on a day-to-day -day basis um, I've never been able to really do that oh my god is that a wall yes it is and that is proper close to that if we can get round there at all and uh come on, I might have to put in a can we not oh okay see it's already gone wrong for me this is what this is me and this is farm so I'm gonna have to put a little uh little, um section down there of grass or something I think that's proper close to the wall that is um so yeah I do have a lot of respect for for the for the uh full time farm sim creators out there it's never been something i've been able um, able to do um, on the day to day so ggs to to all of you you know you know who you are and most of them will be in my recommended underneath anyway okay it's looking like we're not gonna get a full headland round um, until we have to uh, get the tractor and trailer over i was hoping to get around there but you can just see over there in the distance you can see the tractor and trailer and we are 65 percent full nearly so i don't think that's gonna happen um but uh it seems like we're getting a fair decent yield off of, off of here considering it's just straight off straight off the bat we're not even uh you know i didn't even touch any of these fields it is literally spawn in buy some equipment and uh, get straight into the field so, but, um, but yeah, as I was saying at the start, we're going to see, we're going to see how, how this goes, see how I feel. I'll tell you something now, right? Drop me a comment in the comment section. If, if you miss me playing farm sim, drop me a comment in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts and feelings. You know, I don't, I don't want to hear any of the, you, you play what you want to, GD. You know, if farm, if farm sim's not your thing, just, just play the games. I don't want to hear that. What I want to hear is, do you, do you want to see some more farm sim? Hello, that was loud. Um, do you want to see some more farm sim brought to either YouTube or Twitch or both? That's what I wanna, what I wanna hear from you all. Um, but as we are talking about farm sim, as I'm playing farm sim, I'm a giant's partner, as many of you will know. FS25 is coming out. Um, I've seen a few bits and pieces. I might actually, I might want to change my answer. We might make it round. Actually, um, I've seen a few bits and pieces. It does look good. It does. It does look genuinely good. They've changed a lot of things. I love the layout. GPS is standard now. I mean, it's going to be a basic GPS, of course. Um, and I do think there's going to be either a GPS add-on mod or um, or something will definitely uh, be on the 
horizon um, but um, but you know but as I said GPS is standard I mean that's that's something a lot of people have been wanting um, for a very very long time actually so but let me know your thoughts and feelings in the comments section below as I said I am a Giants partner so if you want to use code uh, Gamer Dragon on checkout then um, I'll try and leave links to my uh, to FS and stuff in the description if I don't as I said just go over to the farming simulator website and uh, yeah use code Gamer Dragon on checkout we are not gonna quite make it to the end of the field we are 98 cent 99 percent I don't want to do a Sean here and run into me crops you know because I mean it's what he does it's just what he does you know and I don't, I don't want to be like that I don't want to be that person you know oh no stop oh god oh, I didn't think this through we didn't think this through um that's the wrong button hang on I need to remember there we go I just I just need to remember what buttons do what now um let's hop out of you uh let's run down to the class we're gonna bring you up i am definitely gonna have to run two headlands on here though that is that is a bit of a given i think and then oh that's backwards gd and then uh, uh we can get the up and downs done i think so let me get this unloaded and then I'll probably slip into a bit of a time lapse, I reckon. Let's do that. Will you will you nah? Have I have I broken something? Do I need to be in here for that to empty? Yeah. Right, I've broken something. I got it. I got it. I've put a cover on this. But I thought, but it doesn't, I don't, okay, it's fine. I put a cover on it and the cover wasn't showing. So, I don't know, I don't know what happened. I don't know. It's, it's farm sim, it's me, I break shit, it's fine, I suppose. But yeah, look, if can't, let's open, close cover. Open, I don't, I don't know. Uh, but it's, okay, it's open now, that seems to be. That seems to be fine. I genuinely, I don't know anymore. What is it with me and FS? I just, just, I just break it. It just, it doesn't like me anymore.
Right, here we are. We are coming to the, well, half, half of the field is done. I've done a little montage. I haven't used VCA. I decided to go um, just hard worker. I might bring course play in and I might try. I might try some of that out. It's been a while since I've used course play, so I might, might have a little tinker about with that. I've also been thinking about maybe just maybe I might change the um, the actual farm layout as well because this is only an arable farm and I do know there are um, we just come out of cab there for a minute um, I do know there are other farms on the map um, I think there's a pig uh, there's arable which we've got there's pig and there's cows I think, I don't know if it's a sheep farm actually, but I'm now starting to think I might, I might go, might set up some cows, I might set up some cows, but I'm going to have to have a look at this harvester or this header maybe, because it's definitely lacking on power, but the one thing I do want to do is, um, I think it's that button there, I do need to set up my VCA let's drop you down now I think you're um, I think you're set up I need to bring me HUD back up then I that would be a good idea GD that would be a very good idea on uh, yeah but no that's not that's not exactly how I want you to be running. I need you a bit more um, up that way. Are you going to be... I think that might miss a little bit, but hopefully, hopefully it won't be, won't be too bad. But yes, we are definitely lacking on on power definitely up the hills um, I don't know whether it's the actual header um, or or what but I mean we are quite I mean we do need some repairing to be done as well by the looks of that I don't know if that's header repair or harvester repair I think it might be harvester because I think the harvester I bought in the in the sale so that might be that that just that needs um needs repairing but as you can see we're struggling a little bit yeah there we go i have um um i've repaired uh repaired it so that definitely it does seem to be i mean we're on a flat now so kind of i suppose um but that does seem to have uh, fixed the problem and i am missing a bit and i know that's going to trigger people out there and I apologize not much but I apologize a little bit I am so sorry that that is happening just think yourselves lucky that I will come back and get it and not just leave it so it's just there like all the time just leave it to wither and leave it to die but I can I can hear people swearing at me right now that's really ridiculous right let's get this unloaded we should be able to get another load into this trailer and uh, we've still got a fair bit of this field to begin on with. Um, it's definitely a lot, uh, a lot bigger than I thought. Whether I might, I've been thinking possibly I might um, split this field in half. And uh, so we've got, we can make two fields out of this. That's not going to completely empty the harvester, is it? Nope. So, right, I'm going to go and get this um, unloaded. And uh, I might um, call the episode there after after that. There we go. That's that all done, all tipped, all in the uh, in the thing there. I don't know um, what I'm going to do because I did say there is a massive possibility that I'm going to completely rip out all of these sheds and uh, build my own little farm up here. There is a possibility that I might do that. Really, really make it my own rather than um, 
using what's there, you know, and then uh, possibly, um, I think the vehicles I'm running at the minute are okay. I might change the harvester out. I don't know. It seems okay. I didn't realize how big the fields were, if I'm being honest, um, on on this map. So there is a possibility that I might might not use this map. I might try and find something a little bit different. Um, I have thought about going back to my court farm, um, my edit that I did. There is a possibility that that um, may be a thing as well. So I did really, really enjoy that map, but. I think I did, um, I did break it quite a bit. Well, not maybe break it, but I definitely, uh, whoops. Um, I definitely edited the crap out of it. That is, that is for sure. Um, put you down, put you on. There we go. We can get this field, uh, finished. This is, this is VCA that I'm using. Um, I used to be a GPS person, um, but... Um, I think it was, might have been the Billion Challenge that me and Mr. Fox Sean did. Um, link to his Twitch will be in the description, by the way. Go and check that man out. Um, he put me in, in touch with the VCA, and um, genuinely, I haven't looked back. I, I haven't looked back at all. I think it's great. You could just, I mean, you could probably do it all with GPS, but literally just couple of buttons couple of configurations and away you go and then just push a button and it it'll take the next the next track to the right or track to the left whichever way you do you tell it to go it's it's an absolutely brilliant mod but ladies and gentlemen boys and girls I hope you have dropped that comment into the comment section let me know if you want to see a bit more farming let me know I'm quite I think I might be happy to do to do some bits and pieces so but please do drop me a comment though please let me know what you think um, the other thing I was supposed to say to you I'm sorry about the lighting and the state of the fucking office and shit but I am this this week when this should go out the week I'm completely gutting the office taking everything out um, and you may have heard me mention in my live streams that we're turning it back into like a, a spare spare bedroom slash office so um, so I will be doing that this week um, so that's why everything's a bit piggledy piggledy and all upside down at the moment so I do apologize I don't have any of my lighting or anything, so it's just, it's just, um, yeah, I'm sorry. I look, I do look very red, and I don't quite know why, I'm being honest. So, I don't think I'm this red today. I might be. It's a possibility. But anyway, look at me waffling on again. Um, right, if you have enjoyed, drop a like. That's the only way I'm going to know that you want more farm soon if you don't drop it into the comment section as well. All right? So, please... Um, drop a like, drop that comment, subscribe over here if you are new, um, because 97% of the people that watch my content are not subscribed. Horrible people. Um, joke, obviously. You watch me lose subscribers now. Um, but, oh shit, crap, never fine. Um, so yes, like I said, drop a like, drop that comment, but more importantly, look after yourselves, take care of each other, and hopefully, catch you in the next one.